Quit filling me with confidence there, Doc. If it's any comfort, I'll be in the Avenger as well. Should anything go awry, I'll be ready. You've opened other Vengates before, right? This isn't all just theoretical. Of course. You were there when Lawrence and I opened the first one. That didn't exactly turn out well. No, but it worked. And we've had success in smaller tests since then, using recovered outsider technology. Well, that's good to hear, I think. Of course, the real test will be transferring something as large as the Avenger. We'll see about that soon enough, though. So, the data from Axis gave you the coordinates you needed. Where do they point? Most definitely. They point to a particularly isolated point in orbit around the alien homeworld. Where exactly is the alien homeworld? It's hard to describe precisely without a star map, but it's approximately 600 light years away from Earth, in the Cygnus constellation. They're a long way from home. Planets that can sustain our kind of life are few and far between, even in an infinite universe. Any idea what we can expect to find on their homeworld? Thankfully, the Outsiders seem to have a similar environment and gravity to our own. No doubt that's why they chose Earth for their conquest. But the rest may be, as they say, quite alien. What sort of defenses would they have? The Avengers' stealth ability should get us past the toughest defenses, but it looks like you'll have to do the last leg of the trip on foot. Just me and my squad in an alien base? Sounds like fun. Their security will no doubt be fierce, but I'm happy to say it'll be limited. They apparently try to keep Origin's location secret, so they can't garrison an entire army around it. We're gonna be relying on your work. I sure hope it makes the grade, Doctor. As do I. You're not the only one whose life is on the line. Can't say I relish the risk of dying so far away from home, but how many scientists have a chance to see an alien world? Don't think of it as dying far away from home. Think of it as dying to save your home. Um, yes. That's much more comforting, isn't it? Please report to Director Falk in office. Agent Carter to Director Falk. I suppose it's time. See you in the Avenger, Carter. Those evacuation orders out, and keep the agents defending the high-profile targets. Yes, sir. Understood. We'll keep everything running until you return. Your inexplicable confidence is noted and appreciated, Chelsky. Well, here's Carter now. Carter, good. I'm told that everything is ready. Yes, sir. Glad to hear it. We'll depart within the hour. That's it? Carter? No speeches? Nothing to say? This isn't the time for speeches, Carter. You know what's at stake, and you know the odds. Yes, sir, I do. I'd expect no less. Don't sound so grim, old man. I'm not that easy to kill. Every man has his limits, but if anyone can pull this off, it's you, Carter. That's because I don't do things halfway. And that's exactly why I picked you. I just don't understand. Our missions have been a success. No, your missions have been a success. If you call losing two towns and barely escaping with your objective successful. And even so, no one else has your success rate in the field. We can get more agents, better training. The Outsiders are the ones with an endless stream of troops, not us. There's only one option. We've got to take the fight to them. Hasn't this Origin been around for... well, forever for all we know? What if stopping him and shutting down Mosaic isn't as simple as shooting him in the head? We've made every preparation we can with the information we have. And if that's not enough, well, you've shown a talent for thinking on your feet. You're telling me to improvise? That's a change. What if we get there and I don't have the tools I need? Don't worry, I've got a backup plan. But frankly, you're the best chance we've got. Supposing we do manage to close the gates, what happens to the outsider forces on Earth? I'm leaving a detailed battle plan. It's currently being distributed to the acting Joint Chiefs. The hope is that once we've separated our world from theirs, enemy supply lines will be cut off and the individual enemy platoons will be severed from the Central Command. This ought to give our military the edge they need to finish things. Doesn't sound like you plan on being around for the cleanup. The odds of us returning from this mission are slim. No use pretending otherwise. I'm ready to go. I'll meet you in the Avenger. You know what's at stake here, Carter. And you know the odds. 
You've survived this long. I know you're the right man for the job. Watch it! Unless you want to blow us all to hell, I suggest you be a bit more careful. So this is the inside of a bona fide UFO. We're taking the fight to them this time, crossing into their world here, penetrating the core of their network and separating our worlds permanently. Any questions? Have you been able to pinpoint the location of the Mosaic Nexus? Yes, we've tracked down the... Jesus Christ, Falk. What the hell is that? We're not attending a peace talk, Angela. I intend to put a stop to Origin once and for all. You've been busy. Indeed. Refining the Illyrium to its most volatile state was only part of the process. Combining that... You did with what? The... Good God, that thing will take out Origin and all of us with it! It may come to that, Doctor. And if that's what it takes to end this war, so be it. Prepare the ship for immediate departure. We leave as soon as the device is installed. Targets up ahead, just around this next bend. Stay sharp, Barnes. We'll be in range of their detectors soon. We've been in range. Looks like Heinrich really came through for us. With his signal jammer, perhaps. I just hope he can say the same for the bloody monstrosity he's strapped to our belly. The explosive will work as designed, Doctor. It has to. They've built their operation under the lake! Hang on! We're not getting in that way. The hole stitches itself right up. Then we unstitch it. Exactly. Set her down. The commando generates a shield, defending against all enemy attacks. This can also be used to protect an injured ally or equipment.
All right, Carter. We need to disable their security system if we're going to pass through that opening in the dam. Right, the Vengate. Actually, that's not the Vengate. Our readings tell us the Vengate is hidden behind the dam, under the reservoir. It's a good bet they're siphoning the dam's power output to manage the aperture's defenses. I see. Okay, so disable the security system. Great. Anybody have any idea how to do that? Weir's pulling up schematics for the dam. Start with the facility's main entrance across the lower courtyard.